And welcome back, troglodytes. Thank you for coming back. I'm glad we could enjoy this together. <laughs> we are at World 3, Under the Ocean with the Monkeys. Level 1, Organic Form. Alright, so this one, it starts off slow, gets fast, and you just gotta go. It might get a little bumpy. Woo! Whoa! All right, I think we're all right. Oh, no, no! No! <laughs> Are we gonna make it? Oh, come on! Come on! We can save this! We can save it! I believe in you, I. I. No! <laughs> that was a lot of fun. I, I was hoping we were gonna make it, but... Oh, well. That's why I love Monkey Ball. Especially since this isn't a super serious playthrough, we can have some fun with it. Come on. There we go. <sighs> that was fun. Reversible gear. Now this is one that, as a kid, I could not get past. Uh, my sister Carrie, old, my oldest sister, was the one to finally kind of discover how to do it. You just kind of kind of come over here. If I remember correctly, it stops, yeah, right here. Then you just kind of got to rush in and get it. Come on. Go, 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 no! It's kind of just a trial and error. But definitely possible. But this, I would definitely say, is one of the harder levels. Ah, oh, no. Because it kind of just throws you off like that if you don't make it the first time. So get enough speed, uh, time it out, and it shouldn't be too hard of a level for you. And we missed it. That's alright. We can wait around. Troglodytes don't mind waiting as long as we can make it. And go! Come on! Uh-oh! Uh-oh! Well, somebody has some monkey... No! See, that's what I'm talking about. You guys can't see it, you can't feel it, but it's pulling you so hard. Which is kind of strange because the actual floor shouldn't be moving itself in there. Alright. Stepping stone. Now, you can be a baller and go super fast, but... Well, apparently we're gonna do that. Oh! Oh. <laughs> that little fish over there. Uh, I forget what level it is, but you can go visit him in that cave. By if you ramp off something hard enough. I think there's a YouTube video on that. Oh! Alright, here's the hard part. Not oh, falling. There we go. Hey, we're doing pretty okay on this playthrough. I'm having fun. I hope you guys are enjoying this. To the dribbles. Alright, this one. Similar story as usual. You got the button back here. And I definitely suggest hitting the button on this one. It might seem easy at first, but this... Towards the end, they get a little bit too fast, and they start becoming odd shapes. Like, some of them are larger than the platform and will kill you without notice, <laughs> and some are uh, smaller than the platform, but most are, fall in that larger category. And I fell off there. Uh-oh, I forgot to hit that button. We'll show you what I'm talking about. Yep. Play button. Run! We are good there. Come on. I'm always too paranoid to go too many at a time. Alright, here we go. This game's just su such nerve wracking at times. 
Alright, we're almost there. Didn't fall off there this time. Oh yeah, now here's the breakdown of the music. And we made it! Alright, World 5, URL. I forget what the URL says here. Something monkey ball, isn't it? I guess we can read it as we go across. Whee! Oh. Well. <laughs> Didn't quite make it there. Cause you gotta ramp up here. You're supposed to try to get as far as you can in those little safe areas, but I am doing a terrible job at that right now. Amusemententertainment.com, I think is what it is. Alright, I guess we could do this. Slower way to do it, but I think we could almost make it. Okay. The hard part is, is if you don't have enough speed, you can't get up these ramps. But it looks like we did okay. Right. Almost halfway through again. Mad rings. This is another one that has the multiple uh, goals. Uh, obviously, in story mode, it doesn't matter if you go one, two, or three. Let's give it a go. Oh! Woo! <laughs> we almost made it to the third goal, but at the end, it's like, no! We're gonna blast you to the moon! And apparently, we just hit the goal there. <laughs> Alright. Hey! No! Hey, this one's not too hard to get to, but eh, if you can get to the third one, why not? Curvy options. It's another one, multiple paths. The only difference is bananas. So if you're going for like an all banana run. Oh gosh, that'd be terrible. Wow, that was terrible. But what I was saying, if you're doing an all banana run, you have to do all four of those within 60 seconds. I'm not even sure if that's possible. But hey, we'll pick up a couple dull bananas. Big props on Dole for sponsoring this game. I think they stopped sponsoring the series later on, if I remember correctly. Uh, onwards to Twister. Uh, Monkey Ball 1, I did play, but not as a child. I thought it was a good game. I think, if I remember correctly, it's a lot harder than 2. Uh, and uh, Monkey Ball, it's like adventure. Oh my gosh. When that game was like first came out, I was so excited for it. And when I brought it home, I was very sad. I hate it when a game messes with its uh, core platform. They completely changed the game. Like, I like the idea of the adventure aspect, but I still wanted the monkey ball at heart. And it just wasn't there for me. Feel free to leave your thoughts on Super Monkey Ball Adventure in the comments, but I'm not a huge fan. Let's see. If I remember correctly, there is a certain stair Okay. I think I've already passed it. Yeah. If you're really talented, and if you watch your map in that corner very, very well... Woo! Well, we'll just do it the legitimate way. Even though I really want to do some fun strats, maybe uh, I'll make a new compilation uh, video of some sick strats and upload that for you guys to watch and I'll commentate over it. In fact, I might still have the saved data of those, which would be awesome. I'll upload that at the uh, end of this series, which I honestly forget how many levels there are in this game, so I'm guessing this will take about uh, maybe two weeks to get through. 
maybe not quite two weeks, maybe a week, week and a half. But we are already at the end of World 3. Junction. Jump to Junction. Go. Honestly, I'm surprised this is the 10th. I think reversible gear should have been 310 because that was a million times harder than this one. Well, it looks like we've made it to the end of World 3 and we are at the new cutscene. Hasn't been hours, man. It's been... It's been like 12 minutes. A little green frog. Baboon guy. <laughs> I just love his monocle design there. It's funny. We finally found you, Dr. Baboon. Give back our bananas! Woo! You're still here. I wonder if that's a, a slight callback to uh, Mario 3 with the frog suit. Or if it's just the frog in general. So long, everyone. I feel a dance party. Soon. Series only gonna be three parts. Will he die here? Nah, we've got lots of time left. Except for here comes a whale. <laughs> I'm not gonna fall for that one. Here comes the big friendly whale. Ah! Huh? <laughs> that whale is just like, hey, I'm a cool guy. Poor baby. Wet himself. I think it's a guy if I remember correctly. I always thought it was a girl, but. Yum. Imagine if whales had uh, eyes that stuck out the side like a... I'm not even sure what has eyes like that, but kind of like an antenna. Am I going to have to stay here for the rest of my life? Yeah, poor Mimi. Stuck in a whale with a whale of a guy. Now we got the dance party going on. The magical spell. Alright, Charlotteites, thank you for watching this episode. Come back tomorrow and we will tackle World 4. Have a great day.